How much does a full colonel make in retirement? Retiring as a full colonel in the military is often the culmination of a long and distinguished career. But how does that translate into retirement pay? Okay, here's the deal. It all starts with what's known as the High 36 Method, a moniker that sounds like it was pulled straight out of a military operations manual. This method calculates the average of your highest 36 months of basic pay, which typically are the final three years of service. Now let's add a bit of math magic, a multiplier based on your years of service. For simplicity, let's say our full colonel has put in about 30 years. That gives you 2.5% per year, which equates to 75% of the average base pay. Let's throw some real numbers into the mix, shall we? Base pay for a full colonel, 06 rank for you military aficionados, with over 30 years of service is around $11,000 monthly, give or take. Take the average, apply the math, and you'd be looking at a rough estimate of $8,250 per month before taxes. But hey, the government likes to take a slice, so don't forget about Uncle Sam's cut. Additionally, there are variables like participation in the Thrift Savings Plan, TSP, which is like the military version of a 401k. It's not Beverly Hills Mansion income, but it's relatively comfortable, especially for a life post-uniform. It's also worth noting that military retirement pay can increase with cost of living adjustments, so there's a nifty little hedge against inflation. So, whether you're taking the dog for a walk along the Willamette or sipping some craft coffee at one of Portland's many cafes, remember, retirement from the military as a full colonel definitely has its perks. And who knows, maybe the occasional salmon run or Portland Trailblazers game might remind you that there's a lot to enjoy, even after hanging up the boots.